Abolish the police. <laughs> I thought you said that you were like for the police. I was. And now you're not. What changed? I drank the Kool Aid, fam. Ah, oh, ah. Uh. No need for that. Don't clap for me. I'm just a man. Oh, okay. You know what? I, I think I got the wrong impression about you. Maybe there's more to you than people think. Why? Hey, whoa! Okay, you're gonna, gonna give me a fatherly on back on the forehead. Okay, that that is not what that looked like. Okay, oh. damn. He was trying to comfort you. You are you blaming me for that? Absolutely. Let him kiss you on the forehead. I'm not gonna do it anymore. The moment's passed. <laughs> Life and tunnel, bitch, I pull up to your crib with the bright red flannel. Yeah, you I know do not what endorse 50-year-old men dancing with model women who are very young, unless, of course, they're being paid for a music... You know, I don't know if that's much better. Uh, uh, oh, I endorse it. <laughs> I would dance with them. I'd pop my top off, too. And you're almost that age, so... I'm almost as good-looking as a supermodel? Is that what you are going to say? How would I be about to say that? I finished oh, the whole sentence. My bad. I, already <laughs> said, I already said you're almost I thought you were going to say I would fit seamlessly kind of into the hot, sexy supermodels dancing around David Guetta. No, I, I wasn't even close. <laughs> to say anything like that yeah oh but you're done yeah what i know yeah see no still not gonna say that okay yeah there's some that might say that but you are cl no you're close to the age of david get give, give him a slack he literally said he's not working on it he said he doesn't have the problem add me on slack what <laughs> he's working on it add me on slack to work at. No, I know. I know what We're it working is. working on it. Add me on Slack. Uh, yeah, I think it's, <laughs> you're mixing up cut me some Slack and add me on Slack. Is that right? That's right. <laughs> you nailed it. <laughs> you cut me. I made a mistake. <laughs> cut me a little Zoom. Cut me a little Zoom? Is that what you said? Yeah. You have been so unproductive lately. I mean, you've been really Skyping off at work. That's stupid. Whatever. Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> Favorite vegetable? Go ahead. Carrot. Really? It's like the only one I can eat without throwing up. Throwing up. Yeah. You are really just like a big child, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I really am. <laughs> You're like a big little kid. He <laughs> loves the candy store yeah. and throws up from vegetables. Yeah, and calls yeah. it anti Annie's. <laughs> yeah, I got some heart problems. I don't have much longer to live. Oh, man. That is fucking tragic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I will have a good time at your funeral, though. I will not weep and I will not cry. I will party. Just like you wanted, brother. That is actually, you know, I, I will appreciate that. But I don't think I'm going to invite you to my funeral, though. Oh, you don't have to invite me. Yeah, you don't get to send out the invites, especially uh -oh. if it's all out of nowhere. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. I guess you're right. Yeah. 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 I'm going to be there, man. Tina's going to invite him. Yeah. You know? Oh, yeah, Tina. Forgot about her. What? <laughs> Dude, we are four questions in. You already <laughs> forgot about your partner. Boys night, you know? <laughs> Boys night! Boys night? Let's go. I really want to make a Bigfoot hoax video. You know oh, what I mean? Like, yeah. get a gorilla costume. You're in it. And, like, I'm, like, filming like this. <laughs> I'm like, there it is! <laughs> <laughs> I really do like that. And we can put Brad in a fish costume and go down to the reservoir and make, like, a fake Loch Ness monster video. <laughs> yeah, I like that yeah. one as well. How are you with swimming? <laughs> Not good in a costume. Perfect. Oh, okay, awesome. Yeah. yeah. You put some rocks in there to help you. Uh, so I just gotta flop on the rocks. No, we'll put rocks in the costume. <laughs> no, rocks in the costume. <laughs> yeah, to help you float. Yeah, to help you float. Yeah. Every good girl needs a little love. Every black boy needs a little love. You said every Bradley needs a little love for when she says every black boy needs a little love. Black boy. Just black boy. As in no. Boy JP. Oh no. Wait, actually, yeah. I don't know if she's talking about him, but oh, yes. No. Guys on the block. You're just another guy on the block. Doesn't yeah. matter your race, Brad. But if you were black, you would be deserving of love as much as anyone else. That's actually very sweet of you. Probably yeah. even more. Okay, I would have stopped there. I, mean, I don't know. You have to go all the way there. I mean, yes, you know. I'd like you more if you were a black guy, Brad. God, see, and this is where you know what I mean. It's like you, you walk somewhere and then right when we tell you oh good job you walked you start sprinting yeah. you know and then you start sprinting into traffic yeah, yeah. yeah. it's like odd it's like yeah. odd the things that you say <laughs> i totally get it <laughs> yeah, i totally get where you guys are coming from with this one specifically oh ah. right it's unfortunate i know seems like you had a pretty brad childhood <laughs> jesus christ riley <laughs> you were on fire today thank you i appreciate that i'm gonna go with woke up like this that is the fourth highest answer for two what months. people would say bringo right there Bringo? Yeah, uh -huh. you'd say that after you got it right. Bringo! He Bringo. was the fourth Beatle. <laughs> oh. There okay. was a fourth guy. A lot of people don't know that. They had a drummer. 
Springo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he smoked crack. No, oh, come on. <laughs> I smoked a little bit. You ever think about doing stuff like some of the shit that these guys say, like smoking crack, for instance, or getting involved uh, with, with a bad group of guys? I mean, I kind of already am if mm. I am in this group. But yeah, so I mean, a real, what the f- <laughs> Oh, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Let me do it like this. So, listen, I'm not really an avid. What the fuck? <laughs> Man, I thought you were gonna be serious about this shit. What? Anyway, so. <laughs> Bad group of guys. Bad guys. Smoke crack? No, I don't want to smoke crack. Uh, that's my answer. <laughs> you say the word, pal. You're my guest. So you know. I, uh, nah, I'm I good. just want to make you happy. I'm, I'm good. Mm-hmm. I think I'm good. John Legend, Christy Deegan's wife. John Legend. That's that's not John. That's not John Legend. Is there anything else you'd like to say? You look like you're pent up. Like there's something you want to get off your chest. Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> and we lost it. And then we've got uh <laughs> We Will Rock You by Queen versus No Condom by the Baby. <laughs> Queen versus the Baby. Oh. I mean, where else can you get stuff like this? Is this like the darkest fucking joke Grant's ever made too, by the way? Why? How did Freddie Mercury die? No! Oh! Silly coincidence? Or is this the uh-huh. darkest fucking joke Grant's ever made in his life? No way. Because if it is, kudos to you being a <laughs> sick, sick mess. And again, I'll use another metric that we've been using here. Sure. The people you meet in this world that love Mumford & Sons, you could... You could just wring them out. You yeah, know what I mean? Like a wet them. towel. Yeah, totally. I do not endorse that. That's behavior. death. I'm talking about death I, and killing. You know, everybody is allowed to like what they like. You no. Know, music is a beautiful thing that we can all share and not cherish. That music. And everybody should be loved and respected for what they not like and appreciate. Is that you good? Some love. Don't oh, sorry. It. I thought you wanted love. I thought you were like getting snuggled. Oh, I thought you were falling asleep on me because nah. what I was saying was so calming and inspirational. Kind of two is the opposite. Yeah. <laughs> um, we're going Mumford and Sons here. When was this song? This is off Beauty, Beauty Behind, Behind the Madness. Madness. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I do remember really like, because that was one of the first albums I actually like downloaded from like uh, Apple Music or something. Or Bear Sherry, you can say it. No, I actually bought it. I actually bought the album is what it was. I bought Damn. the clean version. I didn't know you came for money. It's ten dollars. <laughs> I just didn't know you yeah, grew up with rich parents. That. I didn't know that. I so bought it on my own with my own money. Riley grew up with rich parents too. Oh, you got something in your teeth. Looks like a silver spoon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got that yeah. for you. Yeah. I'm actually gonna use that to do cocaine later. I'm inspired <laughs> by the song. Yeah, we're based and cool and <laughs> like drugs. So. Oh yeah. 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 Three, two, one. Put Many Men by 50 Cent. Said Too Many Men by Devo. I put Sprinter by Dave and Sench. It's Sprinter by Central C and Dave. <laughs> I got too many girls, too many girls. Oh, I got last me to hold a week. I don't listen to British people, so. Yeah, well. What about Coldplay? Especially not Coldplay. What about Cole Bennett? Fuck? Cole Bennett? Is he? I don't think he's British. Yeah, he's from Essex, mate. Let me call him. Oh, I'm a little bit. Yeah, I'm a little bit. We're gonna take you behind the scenes of Red Roses with Will Skies and Landon Cube. But first, <laughs> some bangers and mash. <laughs> Somebody rescue me! I got too many, I got too many, many. I got. They got lost me to death too. Uh, Lil Durk. That is not included. Round Drake, round Drakes. I'm working on my little Dirk impression. That sounded like um, Trippy Red. No, this sounds like Trippy Red. Uh, (laughs) Drop it, let it hang, let it bang. Okay, a little better, yeah. I guess I'm starting again? No. (laughs) It actually rotates by question. You will go first, two questions from now. Okay. You get it? One, three, five, seven, and nine for you. Those are your questions to start off with. No. no, I don't. I, that's wrong. That's, yeah, it's, that's yeah. Very, it's completely wrong. It was a trick question. It's actually it's one four seven eleven are going to be mine. Nice. Nope. It's that's one four seven and ten. Why am I so stupid? You didn't graduate college, buddy. It's true. I didn't. I dropped out for this shit, dude. Yeah. This is what I'm doing with my life. Kind of a good point, because in public, whether I hate it or not, I'm kind of like, tonight, tonight. <laughs> if I hear seven years in public, I'm leaving. Plus, if you start fucking to seven years, it doesn't hit the same as tonight, tonight, you know? We didn't say anything about fucking. We said getting hit. Yeah. Very different. Oh, shit. Uh, of course. I've been edging uh, for seven years, so technically I've been <laughs> fucking for seven years. What, what, did, he, what did Jesus do? Turned, turned a, a fish into bong. He turned a fish into a bong. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fish bong. Oh, yeah. That ding, was... ding, ding. Not there. Guess not. <laughs> Whole lot of red red X on the wow. screen. If we were doing family, if we were playing fam, Planet Family Feud. 
Planet Family Feud. Planet Family Feud. So you guys don't have like an animation that pops up when the answer's wrong. Well, we it, it's like a little X on like no, our scoreboard. No. We can't afford a big one. Yeah. yeah, that's come on, you guys, step it up. All right, our okay. guy charges by like size of the graphic on the screen. Oh yeah, and you can't afford it. No, not yet. It explains why I'm sitting on these weak ass chairs. We bro. told you not to fucking mention the chairs, okay? Bro, I got back issues and you're making me sit on this shit. You're gonna have front issues when I'm done with you. Wow, yeah. wow. Yeah. He's gonna beat the shit out of you, bro. Yeah. I'm gonna beat the absolute dog piss out of that you. That is not where I expected this to go. I just wanted some accommodations because I told you guys I got a bad back and I was just like, please, you know, I just need uh, the, what is it? The, uh, the, what's the chair called? You can't ask your handler for, for, stuff. this is what's, a, this what's is it called? Show. Jamie. You're supposed to pretend nobody's there. Yeah. Jamie, what's the name of the chair? Herman Miller Logitech. Yeah, Herman Miller Logitech. You know, it's, I don't give a shit about uh, Herman Melville, Herman Miller, quick, Michael Herman. I mean, come on. <laughs> quit making excuses. Excuses? Riley, Bro, it's my... your guess. Show them how it's done. Simulation Simulation swarm. Swarm, Fuck yeah. on me sideways. Yeah. That shit. Pops off. Funny feeling by Bo Burnham. <laughs> that is not included. <laughs> Tough answer. <laughs> Rumor on the street is she's been getting a little bit of funny feeling recently from Bo. What the fuck, man? I don't know. Oh. He's funny. He's a comedian. He's funny feeling her up. I don't know. I'm oh. just spitballing. Oh. There is no funny way to feel someone up. Uh, yes, there is. You don't you just... honk them. <laughs> that's, that's actually a good point. If you make a honk sound, that's hilarious. Let's be honest. <laughs> Honk, honk. Oh, Jesus Christ. That would get anybody chuckling. I want to get a horn in my car that the only way I can honk it, there's little boobs there. Ooh, I love get that. Get out of my way. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get a gear shifter in my car that is also a slide whistle. <laughs> Ooh, or you could make it a dick. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. That would be funny. If it sprayed stuff out? No. What the hell? If it spits out motor oil? Oh, yeah, but you have to really go for a couple minutes. Just like between park and reverse, just over and over. Yeah. Well. <laughs> and while you're driving. <laughs> <laughs> what the, what's that guy doing? Ah, he's probably jacking off his shift thing. He's <laughs> jacking his shift. He's on SSRIs. This is going to be a while. I'm waiting for the Brad Taste of Music merch. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were clapping with Versace. I hate to correct this, but... It's not Versace. You're you're collaborating with Versace, the furry version. The furry, the furry yes, furry stuff. Versace. That's yeah. right. Yeah, and I'm very proud of that collaboration. Shout out to the furries, man. Yes, exactly. What the hell? What? I didn't hesitate. I didn't see you hesitated. That's exactly what you did. Shout out the furries. Oh man, that dude. my dad cheated on my mom with the furry. Sorry if I feel a little weird about it. Wait, what kind of? What was their persona? It was a hamster. Hamster like uh, was it like a cartoon hamster? Or was it like meant to look kind of realistic proportions? Yeah, it was too that? anatomical. Ah. I feel that. Sometimes that's that's the pitfall of the furry community. Sometimes they go a little too realistic with yeah. it. Sometimes I see a furry in like a hotel bar or something yeah. and I think, holy shit, is that a fox over there? Sometimes I see a furry in a bar as well and I'm like, yo, what's up with the long face? Oh, and they're like a horse or something, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. When you have children, could I be their godfather? I, I'm, I'm probably going to file a restraining order. Could I show them godfather? <laughs> At four. No, I, I don't <laughs> want you anywhere near my kids. Sorry, but also not sorry. Could I gift them a grandfather no, clock? I, I oh. really, I don't think that doing anything for them is a good idea. If you gift them that, it'll be kind of like a, you're, you're the grandfather clause. <laughs> like Santa Claus. Wow, grandfather. wow. That's yeah. you're grandfathered in. Why are you feeding into it? It's a very serious That's my whole fucking job, Brad. That's my homie right there, dog. You want me to shut down every sadistic thought he has? No, thanks. I've let it run wild. I mean, and look it, at the success we've gotten. He's a mess. You need to get him help. Yeah, yeah, he has all the help he needs. Money and drugs and cars. Hello. <laughs> yeah. He makes triple what I make. Apparently, the ratings just skyrocket when he's on the show. I have a good agent. Scooter Braun. <laughs> nice. You yeah. got him? You picked him up while well, he's a free agent? He's lucky to have me. You see this shit? Wow. I heard he actually dropped Ariana Grande and all those other bozos just to free up more time to focus on him. What's your conversations like when you're, you know, planning your next moves with them and stuff? Bitch, I let the money talk. Nice. Wow. Okay. So hey, we cleaned off the Drake board. It's good to feel. It's good to, what? It's nice to feel something again. You, that's... I haven't felt something since the last conversation I had about Drake. Mm. And what was that conversation? It's about his music. That's it? You don't have some sort of wacky story to tell or like, how is it like an insane conversation or anything? It just I can't feel anything right now. We're not talking about Drake. Do you know Drake has like... 
Yes, <laughs> I do. Yeah, they, I didn't he, even finish the question. He's, he's Canadian. Like, he gets yeah. it. No, yeah. he gets it though. Okay. I don't have to. Yeah, I don't have to baby you. You you get it. Your grandfather is in the Holocaust. Yeah, he had to dress up like a girl and uh, blend in basically throughout the entirety of it. Yeah, your grandfather slayed his way through the Holocaust. <laughs> he slayed and served. Yeah, this is a movie in oh the ratings. <laughs> Boots girl. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. Grandpa gave the Nazis cunt in order to avoid. Oh my the God. Camps. No, I don't. He served cunt to Hitler. No, dude. Yeah. I don't think that's how that went. He demon dropped his way no. out of Berlin. <laughs> <laughs> that is fucking sick. That, man. Nah, wow. man, that nah. wig was wigging. <laughs> Back rolls. You know what I'm saying? He was like eight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that kills the fun real quick, doesn't it? No, he ate. I mean, yeah. oh my God. <laughs> he ate his way out of Auschwitz. I hear what you're saying. <laughs> Holy shit. Brad, do you have any tattoos? Nope, and I probably won't ever get any. I don't know why. I don't like them. Gun to your head. You have to get a tattoo today. What are you going to get? Um, I Knife to your throat right now. You got to get a tattoo. What are you getting? Okay. A I... guillotine on your neck. I'm holding the rope. What are you getting inked on you forever? Okay. If... CO2 leak in your Airbnb. Are you? Bomb in your car. I, I think I... Javelin midair about to impale you in the chest. <laughs> what that dude? You gotta get is this about poison your coffee kid michael myers is a flamethrower and he's at your front door and he's you gotta get a tattoo what you gonna get i think i did get you're seated on the electric chair <laughs> they're about to pull the lever get you're tied door. to two semis they're gonna drive opposite directions you gotta get tattoo right I, now what I, is it gonna be would it even matter at that point blackout drunk somebody's about to give you a bunch of drugs pour them right down your throat a bunch of pills what <laughs> tattoo you get tattoo of the person who did it so they can get arrested Oh, that's pretty cool. That's a smart ass yeah. idea. That's Holy a cool shit! Ass tattoo, that's like Brad. solving a, it's like a cold case files sort of vibe, like a yeah. memento cold case files combo. It's a good answer, Brad. You know how there's cute aggression where something's so cute you want to like kill destroy it. it? Yeah, this is. <laughs> you're like Lenny from uh, Of Mice and Men. Oh God, you're right. You're like Lenny from the Cole Bennett Lyrical Lemonade videos. What? A little stick figure. He hides in all the music videos. Like one of the best cartoons made of all time. It was like a Gumby-ish type of character. So a little bit like Gumby. I've literally never heard. Gumby of was anti-drug. Lyrical lemonade. Lenny. Wait, wait a second. You said what? Gumby, Gumby was anti-drug. So I don't really fuck with Gumby. All right, we'll move, <laughs> we'll move Gumby on then. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Thought we were doing a different bracket. <laughs> Shit. All right, recalibrating. Uh, they disagree. <laughs> they don't get along off the camera. <laughs> they hate each other. That's not true. That's not uh, true at all. It's not true at these, all. These guys can't stand each other. The second the cameras go it's off. It's not true. It's not true. Yeah, yeah, look at look at it. Look yeah, it dude. Yeah. These guys can't stand each other. <laughs> Brad likes cars and like working out and going to the beach and stuff, and Riley likes art. <laughs> <laughs> art is awesome. It's a great way to express yourself. <laughs> great, man. <laughs> you know, I kind of like art too. You know. I don't get along with either of these guys off camera. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. And, I mean, same here. I'd rather die than hook up with a straight white guy, I think. That's fucked up. Depends on 2023. Matthew McConaughey or not. No, I just mean, like, I because he's straight, and so I'd rather die than violate the consent of, a, of a, somebody else. Oh, uh, right. Because if he's straight, oh, there's no way he wants to hook up with me. You backed me into yeah. a corner there. I yeah. see what you're doing. And it do. seems like you guys are a little fucked up on what consent means. I, but listen, I... Oh, no, no, I, no not I, us. It says right there, straight white guy. Uh, so, you know, I... Yeah. I'm a guy, so I don't know. <clears throat> yeah. Or, uh, yeah. I was trying to get him on the show. Yeah. yeah, trying to get Fantano on the show, and before he said a lot of crazy stuff, and now he's just kind of bald like, fucker. Yeah, see, <laughs> kind of snuck one out. Yeah. yeah, he would like him on the show though. I he would. Thinks he'd be really I would good. Be. Nice really cool. guy. Yeah, that one snuck out too, but yeah, <laughs> I don't know. I think we'd have a good time, honestly. Yeah, I think so as well. If that fucker likes beer half as much as I do, he is sober. If that guy likes baby back ribs half as much as I do, <laughs> we're in business. Yeah, he's vegan. Yeah. If that guy likes the Cleveland Browns half as much as I do. We're don't, in business. Don't think he's a sports guy. Yeah. <sighs> if, uh, if he likes Kid Rock's album half as much as I do. <laughs> gave it a not good. <laughs> gave it a not good. If he's got hair half as good as mine, we are. Uh, bald, like you said. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, he likes multi-cam album reviews half as much as I do. Oh, one camera the every time. Just yeah, one, one camera. Yeah. <laughs> God, man. Mm. Oh, shit. If he likes an alphabetical rating system for music, half as much as I do, <laughs> we are going to be locked and loaded. It is numbers. Yeah. It's numeric. It is numbers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
if he's under the age of 30, half as much as I am, we are good. Half as, well, half the, yeah, half as much as you are. Like, <laughs> hold on a second. He's closer to 30, I guess, if we're doing math. No, he is 36. Shit. I don't know what to tell you. Uh, maybe you should start looking for other people to, you know, come on the show. Michael Jordan. Great idea. I don't think Michael Jordan doesn't really even do press in general. I don't know why he'd do our show. I'd love to see the footage of him in a studio. I'm going to put cocaine in your ass. <laughs> I'm going to put my dick in your ass. Was that good? Yeah, was that good? <laughs> yeah. Let me get another. Ah, that one's a little yeah. off. A little, yeah, it was a little harsh. I feel that. I feel that. Okay. <laughs> say it like you mean it, Stitches. Come on, no, I got it. I got it. We should just wrap up for the day. It's been a lot. No, I got this. I can do this. It's like when you get past the modern references and you just get to the weed and start the fi- a melody we all know and love. Don't quince at I'm right. going to go further. I'm going to burn myself on a steak right here. Go. Oh, no. I thought it was kind of fun to hear what the next references were going to be. Yeah! Because, because like, <laughs> it sucks. Like, it's corny. It's so corny. It's so corny. But I... I I was are like, they gonna say Tom Brady? I, I was like waiting for what they were gonna say. It was fun. Brady for Spears. Me. What are they gonna say? It's kind of fun. It's a, I was waiting, you know, to see what it would it's be. A little walk down memory lane, Brad. You like that? I love pop culture. Right, give me this shit. Listen. Okay. You listen. Yeah. <laughs> this was not needed. <laughs> no. This is something a child could write. Wow, you guys really distracted the shit out of me. That was a real thing, right there. <laughs> you guys wanted to put the original here? Well, you, you were saying this it. shit's okay. You Wait. thought about the original? I don't know all the references Billy Joel's talking about, so it's kind of like yawn to me. Yeah, what is he he's saying? He's talking about like the Berlin Wall. What the fuck is that? Yeah, I don't know that shit about yeah. that. I only who know who is about... Ronald Reagan. Literally, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea who any of these people are. I, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> that's why I liked this one. Tiger like, King. I feel Kanye. like. Do you remember Tiger King? We Dude, all watched it during the pandemic the, in March. The the, the of March of the, 2020. She killed her husband. Like, Maybe like, she might not what though. The she fuck? might not. He might be in Cuba. And then these two are entertained by jingling keys. Keys is yeah. what this is. Do and if they do don't vote this through, I swear to God. Do the keys. Do you <laughs> big fake Bjork fan. Brad Taste and Music. Wouldn't you call this shit hipster garbage anyway? Yeah. Oh, yeah, brother. This, he already did. Why do you yeah. even care? I'm right there with you. No, Bjork's great. Yeah, if you like suede elbow pads on like a tweed blazer. <laughs> I don't think you like a lot of uh, women singers. <gasps> He's got him. <laughs> what you gonna say to that? Johnny Mitchell. Actually, Johnny Mitchell's amazing. That's a great answer. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. Hey, fair enough. I'm an ally again. <laughs> tell that, tell that, tell that. What the fuck is this? Wait, I didn't even hear this. What? Yeah, Krabby's Step. Krabby Step. It's for the SpongeBob movie. That is insane. That yeah. is like the worst. That is beyond. That, <laughs> that is like corporate <laughs> meme, like gripping garbage. Riley loves it too. He's about to say he loves it. He's gearing up. I can see him. Right oh no! <laughs> He's, I can see it in his eyes. I see the twinkle. <laughs> Listen, I love Spongebob. I know okay. you do, buddy. I idolize Sway Lee. I know you okay. do, buddy. <laughs> I look up to Tyga. When you put all those things together, boom, boom, boom. It's like the bubble bowl for me. I mean, this With shit the is. bubble bowl. <laughs> I just think, like, if you are at a party and somebody put on Chug Jug with you, <laughs> that shit would go crazy. I don't think so. I think nah, that I would be like. Yeah. That's like lean sipping music, though. You know, Chug Jug for you. <laughs> Right? I guess. Um, but yummy. It's like, what the fuck are people going to do with yummy on, you know? You like this one? Yeah, I guess I could do that. <laughs> I got that yummy, yummy. It's not bad. Yum. It worked. Uh, uh, yeah, bae. Yeah, bae. God! Last year, I did all the politicking. This year, it's time to focus on the vision. I, I don't know the next line. That's okay. I was just telling you. That's kind of like oh, my mantra yeah. for this year. Oh, yeah, I'm focus yeah. on the vision. I did a lot of politicking last year. <laughs> you uh, did. Door-to-door campaigning. Unnecessary. For local politicians that I did not even know what they were fighting for. What do you know about local councilman Tom Brawlin? Tom Brawlin? Is and that the, a real and name? And the people go, well, not much. And Riley would say, me neither. Let's <laughs> get to the bottom of this. You got a desktop in there? You got yeah. a bathroom? I also got a pee. You'd be uh, drinking those big lemonades. <laughs> yeah. My Google was broken, so I needed yeah. to use somebody else's. I went door to door. Google. And I got really good at small talk. And yeah, that's what I was kind of trying to get out of that experience. Nice. Still do not know who Tom Brawlin is, though. Play it again, girl. <laughs> There's another one. I've never played this. The game? Yeah. I don't even know what sound or what game it is. But... To Mario Coin. Sonic. Sonic. Oh, Mario. Oh, it's, it's a frogger. Sonic. Yoshi. Monic. Sario. Manic. You are playing Manic. Sario, I'm Manic. <laughs> <laughs> Mario, I'm Sonic. Nice to meet you. I'm fast as hell and I'm a hedgehog, but I'm blue. Me and Brad. Me and Brad. Shit. All right. Me and Brad. Oh, hey, hey. That's fine. I don't fight over him. All right, cool. Uh, well, now, I well now you don't even want me? Yeah, now this feels like That's there's, it? No, there's no demand. I kind of like you on there. You're just trying to, get, you're trying to get to Dignan through me, huh? No. What? No, that's exactly what you're doing right now. Hey, what the fuck?
is this? For me, I specifically remember because it was like one of his old videos. And he was like, I'm not feeling a light nine. I'm not feeling a strong nine. I'm just feeling a cozy nine. That's literally how he presented it. And that just lived in my head for some reason. So I was like, oh, I know. Because he literally like spells out the answer. You know? Yeah. You ever think it'd be like more useful to maybe remember your mother's birthday than <laughs> how Anthony Fantano says things verbatim. God damn, man. Why you think you, you gotta, gotta maybe rearrange some stuff, you open up a little extra space me, in there? Man. <laughs> Shit, I don't need this right maybe now. Maybe throw man. away the old t-shirt that you had since uh, high school. Throw that one out so you can keep a little note that has your mom's birthday on it, you know? Just Thanks. a little advice from a guy who's also forgotten his mom's birthday. I had to rearrange some stuff too. Let, let's hear an example. What did you take out from your brand to make some room for that? How would I know? <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what though, my mommy loves me again. <laughs> and her birthday is? August. <laughs> I'm not gonna dox my mom. They already you got her address, dude. I'm not gonna give her birthday. You can imagine Beastie Boys. We're not doing to do, 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 we're not doing to yeah. <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> we're like the Beastie Boys of YouTube. Yeah, a lot of people have yeah. said that. Yeah. We're like the Beastie Boys of YouTube. We're the Mr. Beastie Boys of YouTube. Love it. Mr. Beastie Boys. Yeah, yeah. that's good. <laughs> I'm going to put that whole shot in a fisheye lens. Nice. Nothing you can do about it, Brad. Yeah. That whole last shot's going to be in a fisheye lens. Oh, okay. Who the I don't fuck care. ever said fish see like that? What? You can smoke muskrat oils. That'll make you see God, buddy, but I don't think you're ready. I don't think I'm ready either. Fuck I think no. I'm, I'm cool with where I'm at. You yeah. know, I've been <laughs> two years sober from weed. I've been taking my life in a very positive direction, working very hard, you know, taking care of my family. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to belittle your progress. We are all proud of you here at Hive Mind. Yeah, and come on, clap become. it up. Clap don't it need up. to clap. You don't I'm need clapping. to clap. I think clap. it's sick. I want to show people that you don't have to do drugs or kill people or, you know, export weapons across the border to be cool. <laughs> and that wow. was like how my brain went. That's, That's valid. Genius, man. That's you not know. genius. I mean, it's just I'm neurodivergent as fuck. So yeah. I'm definitely showering after this video. Man, I wish I could. When was the last time you showered? I don't know how. <laughs> no one ever taught me. Never got to shower with my old pop. Oh, wow. That's sad. <laughs> that is sad. <laughs> Express remorse for that. I never had oh, I do. Okay. Give him some pity. I never showered with daddy. Yeah, he never got to shower with his old man. Yeah. He, he grew up with money, bro. Yeah, he stinks. And it's not his fault. I he took a hose learned. bath. We just fill up the backyard till it got flooded and I don't Sure, your mom okay, slept around a little bit, but I wouldn't call it a hose bath. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> you don't have to play hockey to be cool in high school. I honestly think you look good on the tractor. <laughs> what? Pop your shirt off, Brad. No, you look good on what? The there's no buttons on my shirt. I know softball's just for girls, but I'll talk to the coach. <laughs> So earlier today, I was doing research on foot fetishes, <laughs> and I found out that the reason people have foot fetishes is because the part of the brain that perceives feet is right next to the part of the brain that perceives genital stimulation. Really? That's really what it is. And I also found out that the part of the brain that perceives babies is right next to the part of the brain that perceives food. <laughs> and my cousin hit his head really hard a couple weeks ago. And so those receptors switched. So now when he sees a baby, it's like he's looking at a, like a pot of gumbo or a sizzling steak. Oh, that's awesome, man. I mean, he starts salivating. That is awesome. And it's not like, no, he hasn't like tried it or sure. anything. He hasn't okay. tried yeah. one or All anything right. like yeah. that. Like, All right, that's but fine. I mean, when he walks into a daycare, I mean, his mouth starts watering like it's a breakfast buffet. That is awesome. Does he have a kid? No, he doesn't have a kid. So why is he going in the daycare? I mean, that's, I mean, he shouldn't. That's what Following I'm saying. That's nose. what I'm saying. It's just kind of like, yeah, he hasn't done anything yet. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> but like, what are you even supposed to do about that? I mean, I'd just hollow out that soft spot and I'd put an egg in there and make like a hot pot. I'd press in the soft spot. That's, you know, that's flying a little close to the sun, don't you think? And I like would crack an egg in there. I don't know if he's going to stop at the egg if the bowl is appetizing. Well, I'm saying you eat the kid. Well, no, no, no. That's oh. what I'm saying. Like, you shouldn't do that. Oh, maybe put it on like a rotisserie and put it like five feet above a fire and let that sucker spin for like 14 hours till the meat's so soft it like drips off the bones. I mean, dude, he is like losing his <laughs> mind trying not to eat children. That's kind of like all oh. of your solutions have been eating children. Yeah. That's not, he shouldn't do that. Yeah. He thumped his head and now infants are like cheeseburgers. Maybe like simple like garlic butter, rosemary, oven, 365, two and a half hours. He does not need recipes. Broil it for the last for 15 kids. minutes to get it no, crisp? No, this is not, this is exactly the opposite. I'm uh, saying like, how should he restrain himself? Right, I'd use a cast iron pan, white wine vinaigrette with a shallot, 
Oh, and maybe no. some tarragon. I would take uh, the baby's ass, the fat part, and I would coat the pan <laughs> in that baby <laughs> fat. Uh. And then I would get all the lean loins and stuff, and I'd give them a nice hard sear on the cast iron. It does sound good. I, I, I will say, <laughs> yeah. like tarragon right. and, and baby fat. I mean, <laughs> yeah. wow. But I, but still, again. What about a 30-day dry age? I know it takes a little extra time, but that, I mean, it really does something to the meat. By that time, it's basically a toddler. Yeah, I don't yeah. even think he'll be hungry. Yeah, he shouldn't go down that route, man. It's a messy, messy road. And once you get a taste, you know what they say, Brad. That you need help. Nothing compares to the taste of human flesh. That's what they say, man. It is the most dangerous game. And the most delicious filet. I'm just going to tell him to get a new hobby. Maybe start collecting stamps or something. You ready, Brad? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm excited to get back into the game, you know? You need help. You bring a kind of chaos to these videos I can't really keep up with. You are projecting. <laughs> you know what projecting means? No? All your talk about drugs, neighborhood yeah, cats, okay. and kind of reminiscing about high school, not showering with your old pop pop. All that stuff really throws me you're, for a loop. You're just going to let him. I mean, he's kind of right. Gas oh, like me. What is too much for the videos? You know what I mean? Yeah. Kind of like keep that to yourself. You probably shouldn't even put that kind of stuff on YouTube. People will start to lose faith in the comedic nature of the show and just start to think it's a deranged individual <laughs> spewing nonsense <laughs> at a camera. And people will start to feel bad for not really laughing with it, but laughing at it. And over time, the fan base will just dwindle into a cesspool of sympathy. I don't know if it's all just going to be sympathy. I think a lot of it's going be outrage and uh, resentment. Well, that's something you'll have to deal with. And just know, if I dipped my mouth in a bucket of salt water for 30 minutes and I licked you, my tongue would be coarse enough to pull your skin off. And I could do that as a form of torture and eventually kill you. <laughs> Grant, you said the show was going to be normal. You I told me. Yeah. You yeah. said no, that you, you would said you would keep that. them on their best behavior. Abnormal. I shot the gorilla. But I did not shoot that little kid. <laughs> yeah. That's why I think we should put gorillas in schools. Really? What? Gorillas in schools? Like, yeah. to prevent? Like, what do you mean? Prevent? <laughs> I don't know. What, why do you put them in schools for? <laughs> to rip the kids apart. What the hell, man? That's not going to help anything. The education system's in shambles, brother. <laughs> are the teachers going to have guns in this scenario? Hopefully. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, all the kids yeah. are going to die. Yeah. Well, okay. Yeah. I just want the weak to get ripped off. <laughs> the weak and slow. Yeah. And the teachers should get the thrill of shooting a giant beast with a high caliber rifle. <laughs> like the heroes they are. Sure, or just the primal humans they are. Right. You know, everybody's got that urge to blast a beast. Yeah. <laughs> and the gorillas, you know, get their blast <laughs> Bloodlust. I have an interesting perspective. One, I've reviewed this entire album, and two, uh, Ronnie Radke is literally my bitch, uh, and, oh. he, and he constantly messages me on uh, on Twitter. I won't say what he says, but basically, uh, he's a giant man child. Well, he's growing up to be a big boy. Yeah, so. hopefully, eventually. But I mean, <laughs> even though this came out like eleven years ago, you wouldn't know. Uh, his music has <laughs> just continued to suck ass. But this is. <laughs> This is somehow his worst, regardless. I mean, this song is, I feel like a spectacle, and I'm glad that it's become a giant <laughs> meme because it will allow him to never live it down. No. Least, yeah. That's real G shit. What are you doing? Hello. This thing on? <laughs> That's it? <laughs> That's all you're doing? What's up, Detroit? <laughs> you guys ready for some jokes? <laughs> I like it. The yeah, paranoid comedian. Who in the crowd's ever watched a movie with their girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good. So you didn't even get to the airport and they're they're checking you at TSA. It's all right, buddy. Calm down. It's like what did Zach Braff ever do to TLC? <laughs> it's a scared comedian. He's kind of skittish and scared. You know when you get to the airport and TSA starts patting you. Oh my god! You got it, sort of. Yeah, it's like the scared comedian. Yeah. I was listening to the '90s R&B station in Detroit the other day. I didn't know the Learning Channel made music. <laughs> You're doing a great job, Brad. Oh, I appreciate that. You know, I was... don't worry about him. He gets hey, real committed hey, to a hey. bit. Well, no, no. The only way to get him to stop is laugh and tell him the joke's good. Uh, hey, your joke's good. You're funny. <laughs> laugh. You're funny. You're good. You're a good comedian. You gotta laugh though. Stop taking. Oh. We should go back to giving housewives cocaine and sending little kids to war. I completely agree with it's that. When this country was at its best, yeah. cars should get two miles per the gallon. <laughs> <laughs> and not all the racist stuff. Obviously, we'll skip over that. We'll skip that stuff. Yeah, yeah skip that. Hey, I'm proud of you. And you know what? Send the kids to war, but also put them back in the factories. Oh, I completely agree with that. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, God. You like you getting your hair pulled in the bedroom? <laughs> From yeah. behind? You got to like that? I don't know how we got here, but... Get closer with us. Share intimate things about yourself. Yeah, maybe like when it's not filming, but like you're asking me, do I like what I like in the bedroom? Like, All right, does any friend of yours like getting their hair tugged on during the nasty stuff? I don't know how to answer this. I feel like it's very obvious that you're alluding to whatever I answer is going yeah, to be safe. about We're talking me. about a friend. Friend of yours. <laughs> okay, if you really want to know. Come on, you remember Megan Gallagher. <laughs> I don't <laughs> Everybody not, really not, do not know Megan Gallagher. We I used don't to dance know around to I Want It That Way by the Backstreet Boys.
No. And her mom came in the room and accused me of being gay. What? And then I was like, I'm seven years old. I don't even know yet. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Just because I like the Backstreet Boys? Give me a break. Can you sign this for me? What? No! It's the rib you broke. The least you could do is fucking sign <laughs> it. It's a hairline fracture. He'll be all right. Oh, that's awesome. This isn't much yeah, of a dude. signature. God, you are a You child. write really big, yeah. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> all right, I'm going to go with frequent Drake collaborator and a great up-and-coming artist, Smiley. That is not included. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> Prada and Gucci, they yeah, all go together. Do <laughs> 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 swear. He's fire. I love Smiley. Dude, his album is so good. He's like, I can't go to jail. The food there's icky. <laughs> <laughs> I've loved you ever since I first met you in college when you were doing a keg stand. <laughs> I saw your butthole from the back and I said, that's going to be my wife. <laughs> you had a little tattoo of Garfield smoking a doobie. I said, man, that's rad. <laughs> One day on the quad, you covered yourself in wet cement and you ran up to the dean and high-fived him in the ass. <laughs> said, holy smokes, this woman's radical. And when I found out your dad was the dictator of Venezuela, it was a dumb deal <laughs> who in their right mind gets accused of something and pulls out a ukulele yeah. it honestly changed the connotation of the ukulele forever yeah the ukulele stock market i think was already low once 21 pilots picked it yeah. up and ruined totally, it totally. but then i feel like colleen is like the start of the great depression yeah <laughs> the ukulele guy yeah. the ukulele tycoons are like motherfucker <laughs> yeah. gamer expert, you're like a bro. gamer nerd a gamer girl fucking nerd dude say ooh woo ooh woo Ugh, never mind. I take that back. I wish I didn't ask. What do you mean? You told me to say it. I know, but I now know. I have like this bad, yeah. cold chill up my spine. <laughs> oh, whoa. I'm just like doing, I don't know. Isn't that gamer stuff? I, I honestly, I don't even know. You did good, man. Okay. <laughs> Cross eye, like. I don't even know if that was hot. <laughs> like the way that I did it. Cause I, I don't know how they do that. They usually make that face pretty well when they have like a controller up their ass. It's like the requirement. <laughs> He's not wrong. <laughs> okay. I like the guy. Seems like a good guy. Decent character. A hard worker. Sure. I'm not a fan of that kind of fucking content, though. I like guns, drugs, violence. <laughs> Whores. No. You didn't say that, so I don't, I don't, say that. don't put words in his mouth. Yeah. If you're going to put something in his mouth, it better be drugs. <laughs> exactly. Thank you, Riley. <laughs> or, or, gun. or gun. Yeah. 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 Or a gun that's full of whiskey. A squirt gun. Yeah. Whiskey squirt Whiskey squirt gun. It's classic. Yeah. Yeah. I love that one. Yeah. yeah. Syringe shot. Put a syringe <laughs> shot down there. No, I'm not that. Kidding. <laughs> Shoot yeah. Doctor's orders. Yeah, it's, yeah, it works. You got a favorite, like a like a favorite R and B song that we could sing for you? Uh, who let the dogs out? Oh, who let the dogs out? Who? Who? Oh, I almost fell asleep right there. Who this is so beautiful. Who let the dogs out? Yippee ki yo! And you love it? <laughs> <laughs> That's your whole take. Okay. Body is a wonderland. I got a fast pass. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> I ride all the rides first. <laughs> I took a, took a ride upon your boobies, baby. Oh, oh God. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Feel up on your booty, baby. Fuck. Fuck, bro. <laughs> Fucking shit, You are bro. very touchy-feely today, Dignan. I'm on a lot of Molly, fam. Oh. Oh. And you are soft. You're like a little... Like a Brillo pad or something. I don't know. Brillo. You're like iron wool. Iron. That, that, none of those things that you named are soft. You're like brick. <laughs> soft, soft little brick. Soft like a brick. Yeah. Do you know what soft means? I wish. I think. Okay. <laughs> I think I wish. Sometimes the information is too jarring, and I'm. I wish I could go back to not knowing. You ever learn stuff like that? Like the truth about. Blank. Yeah, I was really high and I saw my own skeleton. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Exactly like that. How did you see your own skeleton? Like, oh, you said he was really high. Yeah, like what happened is like I was like, uh, it started with me seeing like things in like stop motion and then I saw like yes or no answers, questions for like thoughts and this shit was like, and then I started seeing like, I closed my eyes, I saw like my own physical blueprint and then, uh, and then I wanted to uh, erase all of that because I would never needed to know any of it. Yeah. So, yeah, understand. I freaked out digging, look at that. Damn, 
Spinning like Fentano, bitch, I pull up to your crib with the bright red flannel. Yeah, you know what it is. It's the big follow beat and the beat connect your kids. I'ma take their baby mama and I shoot a couple vids. 